Well, tonight, the state issues a warning to a local animal shelter after workers there euthanized a four-month-old puppy named Shayla. This is a story that's gone viral, not just in the Carolinas, but as far as California. Thousands of people have called, emailed, and sent us Facebook messages saying Shayla didn't need to die. Here's the backstory if you don't know it. Shayla reportedly bit a worker while he was taking her to an animal rescue group. Shayla was taken back to the Anson County Animal Shelter and placed in a 10-day quarantine. But six days later, she was put down to be tested for rabies. Test results came back negative. Tonight, the State Department of Agriculture says the shelter mishandled the case. In a warning letter issued today, the department says the shelter failed to fill out the proper paperwork. But some say that warning isn't enough. They want to see real changes. I really hope that North Carolina law gets changed so that every dog that doesn't pose a risk is afforded the opportunity to live out their quarantine period and that they are not euthanized unnecessarily. The state warned the shelter that further violations could result in fines of up to $5,000. If you'd like to read it, we've posted the entire letter on our website, WCNC.com.